Hello and welcome again to Patio Prayer and Praise Time, hashtag PPP time. Hello, my name is Rose, a.k.a. Graham Graham, Mama Rose, whichever you prefer. My name is Daryl, a.k.a. Pop Pop, Paul Paul, Big D, and welcome to Wisdom for the Family. And again, we just want to say thank you to everyone who has subscribed to our channel. And thank you to everyone who's going to subscribe to our channel. But this is just a little preview to let you know what our channel is all about. And as you may know, as of 2020, we have been married for 35 years. Yes. And we're just sharing our experiences as raising four children, as well as our experiences as a family and marriage. And our children at this time is 39, 34, 31, and 28. So, we've had some things that we wish we would have done differently. So we will be sharing some of those things. And what are one of those things I think that comes to mind with you, Daryl? One of the things that comes to mind to me that we should have did earlier in the game is uh, studied that book of Proverbs and poured it into our children's heart. I mean, the book of Proverbs, uh, include the wisdom of God that God gave Solomon, one of the smartest men in the world, right? Mm -hmm. And so when God gave him that wisdom, he gave him the wisdom to rule his people. But as a result, he gave him the wisdom also to rule money and then gave him money and gave him wealth as a result of the wisdom that he gave him. So when you look at the uh, book of Proverbs, uh, it kind of reminds you of the book of uh, Ecclesiastes when he said there's nothing new under the sun. Everything that we're going through today, Right. All the chaos in the world, even what your family may be going through, it's covered in the book of Proverbs. Yes. So when you think about the book of Proverbs, mm -hmm. think about the wisdom of God for your life today. And you know, what really comes to mind is our motto, how we end every one of our YouTubes. That's right. We always say happy, healthy, wealthy, fit, and, and forgiven. forgiven. Because Proverbs cover yeah, your happiness, it covers your wealth, your health, That's right. it covers forgiveness. That's right. So everything you need to know, it covers it. That's right. But you know, one of the things that, that was your thing that you wish we had did differently. Yes, the only right? one thing that you wish we did. As we're sitting outside on the patio and you can hear we're not that far from the airport. <laughs> so there's an airplane above. However, one of the things that I regret that we didn't do better at was replacing the no's. Cause you know, as a Christian family, you always say no to your children because they're exposed to so many things. So a lot of things that their friends are doing, they are not able to do. So one thing that really comes to mind that's really kind of funny is not, you know, we didn't allow our children really to listen to secular music. And then one day one of my daughters came home, I think she was like seventh grade and somewhere mm -hmm. along in there, and she was crying. I was like, what's wrong with you? And she's like, everybody's laughing at me at school because I thought Christina Aguilera was a classmate. She didn't even know <laughs> that she was a pop singer. Right. And so that's just one of the examples that we wish we would uh, allow or done something differently. Right. And, and another one that was really kind of funny too about movies. Oh, yes. That's right. You want to tell that? Yeah. Uh, it, was, it was years later. I think they became probably yeah, adults. adults before they were able to see some of the movies that we saw now. Some of the movies that we saw, you know, as, you know, growing up or early in the game, right? Like, that their classmate watch. Yeah, their classmate watch, right? They seeing them to this day and they like new movies to them, right? Cause yeah. they just not getting to see them. So, and sometimes I ask them, have you seen so-and-so, you know, now that they're of age? Because, you know, sometimes the sexual content and mm -hmm. some of the language was just a little tough, you know what I mean? And we didn't want that in their spirits, but to Rose's point, we wish we could have replaced that with something else, you know, some other, sought other alternatives, but mm -hmm. the way we were raised, right? It was just the no. old school, they just said no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Can't go play basketball, you know what I'm saying? Can't can't do can't, can't, can't do this, can't do that, right? right? You know what I'm saying? And so uh, we realized that everything that we told folks they couldn't do wasn't a sin. So anyway, right? So that's kind of like what our channel will be about. We will be sharing faith-based solutions to every one of your situations that you're going through, but also we'll be sharing our experience as parents raising four children, three girls, which is a lot, and and a son. Uh, and we do welcome your comments and your questions. You can also email us at yes. pppetime2020 at gmail.com with your questions, and we'll be glad to answer any of your questions. And also visit our website at pppetime.com for any other information 
that you know you might be uh it just may be on the website you may not even have to email us that information may already be on the website for you uh, right. to review view that, review that content right so again this is kind of like what our channel is about it's about family marriage and family it's not just the marriage website i know it says ppp time uh marriage you know uh married and loving it but it's it's marriage and family we're gonna talk about how to be happy <laughs> healthy wealthy fit and forgiving and we will kind of talk about some of our challenges as far as trying to stay fit over the last 35 years yes. so we'll talk about that as well and some of the things that we're doing just to stay healthy because a lot of time it's not about the number on the scale it's about how you feel being healthy so we will address some of those things as well. Well, again, we really do appreciate you for visiting uh, hashtag PPP time and wisdom for the family. And so remember that you are happy, happy healthy, healthy, wealthy, fit, and, and forgiving. forgiving.